Hello. Um, I have been off for a couple of weeks, just taking some reflective time, some downtime, and really just to recharge my batteries. So I would thought I would come back onto YouTube and do another video. My thought is today, um, what date is it the day? 27th, 27th of April. Um, Deterra Essential Oils is a company that um, I work with. And today they have just launched a beautiful buy one get one free offer in some of their essential oils. So I thought, why not talk about Deterra? So, um, and I'm not going to spill a lot of stuff that's on the internet and on YouTube about Deterra and what they do and all the great things and the scientific stuff because that's not me and I would just be regurgitating and reading off a sheet. So I'm going to tell you heart to heart. Um, real raw material as to why I now use doTERRA because because I, I didn't always and I came across doTERRA probably about five years ago my sister-in-law um, used them with the kids and um, I was like oh they're great and I always used essential oils you know we bit of lavender in the bath was the main thing um, I just love lavender, it's one of my favourite oils and I just love the smell of it. So I always use that from, but not really knowing too much about essential oils. So whenever my sister-in-law had these oils, um, I went, oh, they're nice. And because I'm an energy therapist, I could feel that they were really good. Um, and then she told me the price of them and I was like, oh, no, thank you. <laughs> Big mistake. But I wasn't educated as to, as to why they are a little bit more expensive than the traditional essential oils that might be you know, on the shelves. There is a reason for that, okay? And it's all down to quality, okay? And um, that's why doTERRA essential oils, you can consume some of them, not all of them, so you need to double check. And that's why you can apply some of them directly to your skin. And what I would always do with children is always dilute. And if I have any sensitive areas, then generally I am quite good at applying the oils directly to my skin. Um, apart from any of the uh, the hotter oils like oregano or thyme, so always seek, um, you know, if you are thinking of getting doTERRA oils, choose somebody that knows a little bit about health, knows a little bit about, um, you know, that's going to help you along the way in learning about them because it is a mild field and I am by no means an expert. I am learning as I go here, but I have been using them for a couple of years. And um, so that was my first experience. And then um, I will be totally honest, I was at a festival then, a few years later, Sunflower Festival, <laughs> over in here in Northern Ireland. And I'd had a few too many drinks the night before. So the next day I was a little bit um, delicate, let's just say. And I, it was like a holistic festival and there was a lovely girl, um, Claire, and she was doing, um, she had the oils again. So I lifted um, the lavender, she said, um, how you feeling? I said, well, a wee bit of a headache. So lavender and peppermint were the best ones. So I lifted the peppermint. Well, now, I have all my life suffered um, from sinus problems. Okay, now I have them healed now due to, you know, the a physical physical diet and emotional. But um, sinuses has been a big bone of contention along with headaches for me. So when I smelled the peppermint, like I literally jumped. It just, if anybody smelled a tear of peppermint, oh my goodness. It is like, bing. And you can literally just feel your sinuses, um, you know, completely on block and straight away. It is so powerful. Um, and actually, I would encourage you to even smell the doTERRA lavender and compare it to another lavender. They're, they're just like two different oils. Um, because what doTERRA do is um, they source where the native plant of lavender in France, I think it's Provence, is grown. Um, so the likes of, you know, um, ginger in Madagascar, they will go to the, where that native plant originates and they will source it from there. So um, you're getting a lot of um, the real deep connection to the plant and where it was originally grown, which is all to do with energy. And I love all of that. I didn't know that at the time. Um, but that's why they're really, and they're completely potent. There's no binding agents in them whatsoever. No added ingredients. So that's why they have this um, certification um what is it called cptg <laughs> certified pure therapeutic grade certification because of the quality and they have a whole host of resourcers and scientists like you know every little bottle of oil has a number on it and you can check you know you can write that number you can put that number into the into the website and uh, it's sourced to you it's called and it will tell you the journey of this particular bottle that you hold in your hand like today i have spearmint so 
I am very much, I love the physical benefits, but I also am so, probably more so, um, into the emotional benefits. So Spearmint, for example, which is on offer today, the next three days, if anybody wants, it's a buy, buy one, get two free with Spearmint. It is just one of the most beautiful oils, okay? And it's obviously minty, so minty is uplifting, minty clears your head, mint, um, so peppermint's the same. Um, I could not be without, um, peppermint or spearmint to be honest what it also do does is it opens your throat chakra so it helps you with communication this particular one helps you with communication helps you to open this area if you struggle with speaking so like my young my middle son he would be a little bit quieter around the two girls who are quite hyper so i will give him peppermint in the morning going to school um and it's one of the ones he can cope with or not peppermint spearmint peppermint he finds very very strong spearmint's a little bit more gentle and sometimes if like even with the youngest if she's a bit upset like she will literally take it in her take it to school with her one of the things i use for the oils one of the things i love about the oils the oils just get us to stop they get us to stop and be present which is not a lot of which is something that all of us need to work on me in particular so what they did was they just got they were like part of my toolkit that was missing okay so if i look at so i you know became a nutritionist um loved food so knew everything about food then i loved yoga and exercise i became a yoga teacher then i, I wanted to look at the emotional body um and i did reiki and integrated energy therapy akasha records all of that so then i looked at that side um but what i found was you knowing all of that i was still a mother i still my house was a bit chaotic with these three children two dogs a husband you know life getting in the way running a business so much going on that i really struggled to apply some of these i couldn't just suddenly sit down and meditate in the middle of the floor so when these oils came along and i initially bought them for my youngest going to school sorry um, i bought them for my youngest going to school and then i started using them and what i find is whenever i could feel myself getting agitated or feel a reaction or feel stress coming on i immediately just grabbed a bottle put a drop in the palm of my hand aromatized it there's loads of meridians on your hands, okay? And actually, this see this movement? This connects to um, the parasympathetic uh, part of the brain of rest and digest. So it instantly relaxes and sends a message to your brain to relax. And then you breathe that on. And there's actually a part in the emotional part of the brain that can only be accessed via smell. So you're connecting to that, but there's no toxins in that. So unlike some essential oils, when you smell them, it's a lovely smell, but you're not getting the, the chemical, you're not getting that the therapeutic benefits uh, as you will from doTERRA essential oils okay so what I do is I just stop and see that moment of stopping and connecting with your breath what that does that connects you to your heart that connects you to your soul that brings you back to you and when you're brought back to you you're safe you're okay um and what I find is what I call these little bottles of goodness, okay, they're actually called holistic medicine. So that really helped me whenever I was um, paying for something because I had no problem paying, you know, a good bit more for really good vitamins. So I use Cytoplan, which are food grade vitamins for the same reason I use the doTERRA oils, okay. And they're a little bit more expensive than others, but you can feel them straight away. And I recommend no other vitamins but those for that reason. And I've tested them. And... So with doTERRA essential oils, um, this is the reason why I use them, but also they are like a pattern interrupter. So some of the times when we're in a reaction or we're stressed, you can't just sit and go, oh, let's analyze this. But you just need something to inter interrupt that in the moment to just ease things. And one of the things that I would talk to clients about is, um, um, it's like the scale of emotions. A lot of us have not been taught you know how to manage our emotions okay so there are abraham hicks um if you google your abraham hicks scale of emotions you will find a lovely table and it basically talks about the emotions so up here you've got joy and happiness down here you've got grief and despair right this goes up like this like a stair okay it's impossible to jump from grief to jump from despair up to happiness you have to move up through your emotions okay so sometimes what these oils do is they allow you just to feel whatever that is you're feeling and move up the emotional scale okay so you're going to move up to anger you're going to and whenever if you're feeling particularly angry like um my son was upset this morning um and he was upset but he also deep underneath it was anger so what i got him to do was just breathe in and go <sighs> and breathe all the stress and worry out of his mouth you don't need to analyze it greatly and that's what i do is i call these like a toolkit 
okay the other thing i love whenever i buy anything i'm very very um i really hone in on the ethics of the company and they have to have a good energy they have to have a good feeling about it and i never i, I didn't always tune into that i didn't always know what that was um the, this these guys are such a beautiful company and you know even the people that i work with like you know whenever you sign up you get like a, a line manager and then a line manager above that and i'm on such a beautiful line um, I have Lynn Taggart above me and I have Christine above her and then have Elena Brower above her and it's such a beautiful energy passed down this line and they are all you know on the same you know similar same vibration that I'm on into health and healing and yoga and all of that okay so I didn't realize that at the time either um, uh, but it is important and um, within that there is such a wealth of education and information that I can access if I need if I need information on anything in, in, in different groups okay the other thing that I would say is um, books are really important so what I do is if, if when I look at the essential oils okay so let's let's go for for example I'm just thinking of something here what have I got here um, we've got lime okay so you get actually lime and you get lime free when you buy a spearmint, um this week so lime okay so lime you know my kids love juice so what i do is i add a drop of lime into their water um and it just gives it a bit of a flavor um without being sugary okay lime is also it's a citrusy so a citrus is really beautiful for uplifting for awakening you up it's also cleansing so lime and lemon it's cleansing for the liver so you've got these um functional benefits on the physical body and then you've got these other benefits on the emotional body as well okay um and i always check in with my bible so this is this beautiful book called the essential life um i don't actually know who it's by um the essential life it's, it's pretty condensive okay and this will tell me so if i look up let's look up well lime is here actually it's just came up as lime <laughs> okay so let's look up the physical benefits of lime um so um Okay, so the main constituents, it's got limonene in it, beta pinene, gamma terapinene. I am not a scientist, I'm not like, um, so, you know, you can look these up. Um, top property is anti-inflammatory, it's antiseptic, it's antioxidant, it's antibacterial. So making like a kitchen spray with this would be really beautiful with a spray bottle. Putting this into like a facial cleanser would also be really, really good. Popping it in the bath with some essential oils, massaging it into, you know, a, a big area in the body. So like the liver or the soles of the feet, it would be also be good. So it's a, um, uplifting, it's a detoxifier, it's a disinfectant, and it's a diuretic, okay? So um, what it also uses, it helps with a sore throat, okay? So obviously with this virus, and then one of the big signs is a sore throat. So add this to a little bit of water and gargle. It's really good for the respiratory system, also good for this, what's going on at the minute, um, the lymph and the liver congestion. So it really helps to detoxify your body, okay? It's also good for urinary and digestive issues. Um, when you add that into water, it's good for memory, for clarity. So it's really good homeschooling with the children. So there's so many different benefits to one little bottle of goodness. And it's really, really important that you know that you just do one drop. I didn't know this and I was like this at the start and it didn't last very long. Because these are so pure, you need one drop. You just, if you put two drops even in water, you could detox too fast. So you do actually want to be a bit cautious and a bit careful. Careful. and generally you know lime would be the only one that I would even allow my children to take internally um, and I would make sure it's diluted in, in, in quite a large jug okay um, it's also good for exhaustion for depression apply to your ears the back of the neck diffusing um, it's good for herpes for cold sores you can actually put it in a capsule um, and put it into your system chicken pox head lice 20 drops but 15 malika um to bottle of shampoo and apply it's good for pain inflammation um and it's good for emotional balance so that's like the physical constituents and then this you know this book also you know gives you recipes at the back here so you know you can make things like different bath bombs you can make um let me see it's got it's got recipes like there's a there let me see what's that there um mm -mm -mm -mm. cradle cap moisturizer calming colic blend for the children there's all-purpose cleaning wood polish carpet stain remover dusting spray you know bathroom cleaning mold and mildew preventer you've got homemade cola oh my goodness 
okay you've got a lemonade bar you've got like you know lemon bread okay do you know there's so much you can do um with these okay and then you've got also the emotional benefits all right so you've got line here um this is a beautiful book essential emotions and essential oils i love this book so lime is the oil of zest for life so if you're feeling particularly down particularly stuck a lovely smell of that will just wake you right up okay when individuals have been feeling down by discouragement or grief lime elevates them above the mire and instills courage and cheer in the heart and reminds them to be grateful for the gift of life Lime cleanses the heart, especially when there has been an accumulation of emotional toxins due to avoidance or repression. This oil revitalizes the heart space, giving room for light and joy and clears discouragement of thoughts like we could all do with a little bit of that. OK, so I really love that. Um, and the other thing with um, the essential oils. Um, is you can make a business out of it okay you don't have to so like I started I just started because my youngest was starting school and she was very stressed out very emotional and Lynn gave me a free balance and I was like oh, I'll take that it's lovely thank you very much I think it's just a general oil and then I used to give it to Bo every day going to school and she goes mommy can I have my oil can I have my oil and she started just to slowly get better and better and better and I and then the oil was gone so then I got another one and then I decided to get this little kit, okay? So this is like a wee family essentials kit. And this is, it's good to start with this, you know, if you're not sure or you can just start with one oil or I actually make personal blends for people as well. Um, if you're interested, just give me a wee shout. So these are beautiful little five mil sample bottles of like the top 10 most popular oils. There's, there's four blends in there and a six single oils okay and you can get those in a bigger kit as well so that's just a lovely wee handy kit that i started with but it didn't last me very long so literally it was done in about a month and i go around the kids every night um i have a little diffuser in all their rooms and i put the diffuser in so at the minute it's always on guard for the immune system and maybe a, um a bit of lavender or tea tree um two of my children have asthma so i will use air and massage a bit of air with fractionated coconut oil under their feet and massage under the heart maybe down their spine my other one she was suffering tummy problems i'll put the digestive zen around her tummy on her feet and i'll find the reflexology point where the tummy is do you know so that's like a love and the kids love that and now they just do that themselves as well and then i will diffuse i will always massage my feet don't do my husband's um but i'll always massage mine and i notice the difference between when i do that and when i don't do that and what i'll also do is i'll also make my own facial oil um i'll be adding like the frankincense into um like a moisturizer and things like that so you can start to detoxify your body so i'm writing a hormone um hormone course at the minute and the oils are really good for starting to get rid of the toxins in traditional products and then to um to use them to detoxify your physical body and your emotional body so um it's really powerful so there's it's like a world um of um wherever you you know there's, there's so much you can do with it and go with it or not so um there's different opportunities there depending on where you want to go or you just start so if anybody is interested i'm going to pull us a card so these are beautiful wee cards that i bought at a wee oil conference um, called Treasures Within. And um, they're lovely little affirmation cards. So I'm gonna pull us a card as I always love to pull cards um, for the collective and what we're needing to get us through this period at this time, okay? So uh, my Facebook page is My Wellbeing Pal. If anybody wants to contact me there or you can comment um, on my video, okay? My website is mywellbeingpal.com also. Hmm, one card, please. This one. We could all do with a little bit of peace. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? <laughs> peace. I remain calm and focus on creating balance. So a lovely affirmation for today. I remain calm and focus on creating balance. I release all tension and worries. I am grounded in the beauty of my heart and I am at peace. And there is an essential oil called peace, but the oils that it recommends to bring some more peace into your heart are geranium. Geranium is a really good oil for hormone balance and for the heart. We have Melissa, which is known as the oil of light. So beautiful. Oh my goodness. We have lemon, just really uplifting. We have thyme, it's really good oil for forgiveness. And we have rosemary, the oil of change. Love rosemary. So beautiful. 
little bit of peace guys okay so thank you for joining me and thank you for watching and i hope you have a lovely day okay